Blender isn't hard. You're just overthinking it. Yeah, I said it. Put down that four-hour beginner to advanced tutorial and listen up. Blender is the easiest hard thing you'll ever learn. And if that doesn't make sense yet, stick around. You don't need a stack of tutorials to learn Blender. You just need to figure things out yourself. Don't believe me? Let me prove it. Why Blender feels hard. Blender feels hard because you've convinced yourself it's hard. You're looking at all those buttons, panels, and tabs, and your brain's going, nope, not today. But here's the deal. Blender wasn't made to overwhelm you. It's just like any tool. You start small and learn as you go. Remember when you first got a smartphone? Did you read the entire manual? No, you just poked at it until it made sense. Blender's the same way. You don't need to know everything to start. You just need to know something. The problem with tutorials. Okay, let's address the elephant in the room. Tutorials. Tutorials are amazing, don't get me wrong. They've helped millions of people learn Blender. But here's the problem. They also trap you. When you're constantly relying on tutorials, you're not really learning. You're just copying. Think about it. How many times have you followed a tutorial step-by-step, -step, made something cool, and then thought, wait, how do I do this on my own? Exactly. Not everything has a tutorial. Here's the thing about tutorials. They're limited. You won't find a step-by-step -step guide for everything you want to create. You think the team behind Transformers googled how to make giant robot fight scenes in Blender? No. They figured it out. They experimented, failed, and tried again until they got it right. Blender is about exploration. The best creators are the ones who dive in and aren't afraid to mess up. That's how you learn. You don't need someone to spoon-feed you every little step. You just need to know the basics and build from there. Figuring things out for yourself. Here's a pro tip. When you get stuck, don't search for a tutorial called How to Make X Exactly How I Want It. Instead, ask yourself smaller questions. How do I move an object? How do I apply textures? How do I animate something? Look up those answers. Piece them together. That's how you truly learn Blender. And the best part? You'll start to notice patterns. Suddenly, tools like Extrude, Bevel, and Subdivide won't just be random buttons. They'll feel like extensions of your creativity. Blender is like a puzzle. Blender isn't a monster. It's a puzzle. And the beauty of puzzles is that you solve them one piece at a time. Let's say you're modeling a car. You don't start by thinking, how do I make an entire car? You start by asking, how do I make the wheels? You focus on that one small piece, and when it's done, you move to the next piece. Before you know it, you've got the whole car. The importance of experimenting. Experimentation is your best friend in Blender. Open a new file, throw in some random objects, and start clicking buttons. What's the worst that can happen? You mess up? Great. That's how you learn. When I started Blender, I didn't know half of what I was doing. I'd click something, ruin the whole scene, and then go, oh, that's what that does. And guess what? I never forgot it. Mistakes are the best teachers. The myth of knowing everything. Here's a little secret. Even the pros don't know everything in Blender. They know the tools they need, and that's it. You don't need to memorize every button or feature. Focus on what you actually use. You'll pick up the rest when you need it. Trust me, no one's asking you to learn fluid simulations and character rigging on day one. Learning versus doing. There's a difference between learning Blender and doing Blender. Learning is watching tutorials and taking notes. Doing is actually opening the software and creating something. If you're spending 90% of your time learning and only 10% doing, flip those numbers. Make mistakes. Make ugly models. Make something weird and terrible. It's all part of the process. What you really need to know. So, what do you actually need to know to start? Not much, honestly. 1. The basics. Move, scale, rotate. That's it. 2. Object mode versus edit mode. One's for arranging, the other's for editing. 3. How to save your work because trust me, you'll need it. Everything else. You'll figure it out as you go. Blender isn't hard. You're just overthinking it. You're trying to learn everything at once instead of focusing on what matters. It's like trying to write a novel without learning the alphabet first. Slow down. Take it step by step. You've got this. Blender isn't some impossible mountain you have to climb. It's a playground. Jump in. Have fun. Stop worrying about doing it right and just do it. And remember, the only real failure is not trying at all. Now go. Open Blender. Mess around. And make something amazing. Let me know in the comments what you'd like to learn next. And as always, happy blending.